How are hurricanes formed? What are hurricanes? How are they formed? Watch this video to find out. A hurricane is a giant tropical storm that produces heavy rainfall and super strong winds. The wind speed has to be at least 120 kilometers per hour for the storm to be called a hurricane. They are also called cyclones and typhoons, depending on where they occur. Hurricanes form in the Atlantic Ocean or in the Northeast Pacific Ocean. Storms that form in the Northwest Pacific Ocean are called typhoons. Finally, storms that form in the South Pacific and Indian Oceans are called cyclones. How are they formed? Hurricanes start life as a tropical storm. They need lots of warm water and warm wet air. This means that all hurricanes form on an ocean and usually near the equator. When air moves over a warm ocean, the air absorbs water and gets warmer. As the air gets warmer, it starts to rise upwards. As the air rises, more air is pulled in from below, which also starts to get wetter and warmer. As warm air rises high enough into the sky, it starts to cool and releases the water into storm clouds. As the air rises in a storm, it also starts to rotate. If the storm forms north of the equator, it will spin anti-clockwise. If the storm forms south of the equator, it will spin clockwise. If a storm has a continuous supply of energy from a warm ocean, it can suck in more and more air, becoming bigger and bigger. The rising air rotates faster and faster, the storm clouds grow bigger and bigger, and the storm becomes stronger and stronger. Once the winds reach 120 kilometers per hour, the tropical storm officially becomes a hurricane, typhoon, or cyclone. However, if the hurricane begins to move over cooler ocean water, it starts to weaken because it can't draw in enough warm air to fuel the storm. Hurricanes become weaker when they travel over land. But this doesn't mean they're not dangerous. It takes time for a hurricane to weaken, so they can cause a lot of damage as they move over land, especially near the coast. Hurricanes rotate around a circular center called the eye, where it is generally calm with no clouds. This is the safest part of the hurricane. Surrounding the eye is the eye wall, the most dangerous part, with the strongest winds, thickest clouds and heaviest rain. Hurricanes are given names by the World Meteorological Organization, WMO. This makes it easier for weather forecasters to talk about the storm and to warn the public about it. Each year, tropical storms are named in alphabetical order according to a list produced by the WMO. In odd years, the WMO uses female names for hurricanes, and in even years, it uses male names. Most names can be reused for new hurricanes after six years. However, if a hurricane is very strong or causes a very large amount of damage, then the name of that hurricane is retired and won't be used for any new hurricanes. Two examples of this were Hurricane Katrina in 2005 and Hurricane Ian in 2022. 